In this video, we are going to talk about top 10 emerging technologies that will change our world. So before starting, please like this video and subscribe to this channel for our future updates. Business leaders know they must prepare for technological upheavals in the years ahead. But keeping up to date on new technologies to say nothing of understanding their complexities and forecasting those shifts is an overwhelming task. To help organizations find their footing, the CompTIA Emerging Technology Community releases an annual list of the top 10 emerging technologies. What makes this list special is that it focuses on which emerging technologies have the most potential for near-term business impact. Here are CompTIA's picks along with a quick encapsulation of each technology and some potential business use cases. Here are the top 10 emerging technologies that will change our world. So let's start. Number 10. Artificial Intelligence. General AI, a system that is self-aware and commands intelligence equal to that of a human, is the holy grail of artificial intelligence development. These theoretical systems would be on par with us intellectually until version 2.0 arrives, and we slide to a distant second. Until then, we'll have to make do with narrow AI, which consists of machines that execute relatively specific tasks. Although this may appear to be excessively restricted, narrow AI already powers systems such as spam filters, Google Maps, and virtual assistants like Siri. And its applications are expected to expand even further. What we're witnessing now is that machine intelligence is spreading out a little bit from those narrow peaks and become a little bit broader, physicist and machine learning researcher Max Tegmark told Big Think in an interview. Chatbots, logistics, self-driving cars, virtual nursing assistants, personalized textbooks and instructors, and even artificial creativity are just a few of the applications that narrow AI has the potential to improve or bring to light in the next years. Number 9. Natural Language Processing Natural language processing is a branch of artificial intelligence that tries to create systems that can understand and communicate using human language. Does it appear to be simple? If that's the case, it's only because you're reading these words with a mind that has been endowed with the gift of language by evolution. Algorithms, on the other hand, aren't that fortunate. They have a hard time deciphering the jumble of symbols, gestures, noises, and cultural clues we employ to convey meaning and ideas. There's a clear issue with using deep learning to learn languages. It's because words are arbitrary symbols, and they're essentially different from visuals as a result. For example, two words with the same meaning can have completely different letters, and the same word can imply different things in different circumstances, says Will Knight for MIT Technology Review. When algorithms ultimately crack language, there will be a lot of business applications. Consider chatbots, virtual editors, market analysis, live conversation translation, resume readers, and phone auto attendants that don't enrage every caller. Number 8. Robotics. In 1962, the first industrial robot punched the clock. Since then, technological improvements have progressively increased robotics employment presence, and robots will continue to migrate from factories to first street to do rudimentary chores like cleaning and deliveries in the future years. Such improvements have kept the Luddite flames burning for over a century, so one problem for business executives will be convincing their employees that robots aren't coming to take their jobs. In reality, as more individuals migrate into low-skilled, human-centered employment, the transformation will almost certainly be good. Integrating robots into the workplace can be a challenging and dynamic process. While workers may first fear for their jobs, the final result is a warehouse full of happier, healthier humans who remain the focus of a competitive firm, argues Melanie Wise, CEO of Fetch Robotics, in a World Economic Forum article. Number 7. Blockchain. Bitcoin, the much-hyped cryptocurrency, did not make the list, which may come as a surprise. However, the blockchain, a technology's online ledger, has superseded the digital currency as the rising economic star. A blockchain, unlike traditional, centralized records, is decentralized. The permanent record is distributed across the system and is not stored in a single location. This architecture makes it more difficult to misplace or tamper with documents. 
Blockchain systems are effectively censorship-proof or seizure-resistant, said internet entrepreneur Elad Gill in an interview with Big Think. In other words, if you live in a country with poor governance, the government can't come and steal your asset. It also implies that no third party can remove your data accidentally, or that you can't hack a third party to get your data, though clearly, you can still attack a blockchain. This is why blockchain has piqued the interest of businesses that need to keep records, that is, all organizations. And the number of possible applications is amazing. Hospitals may use blockchain to store and distribute health records. It might serve as the foundation for a safe online voting system. It might keep track of logistics in global supply chains. There are, of course, a plethora of cybersecurity applications. Number 6. Augmented or virtual reality. Affordability is improving, processing power is expanding, and high-profile players like Google and Facebook are entering the game. And the growing popularity of augmented reality apps on cell phones may help future sales. Microsoft Mesh and its competitors want to cash in on our new remote working future. The idea is to build virtual shared areas for corporate teams to have meetings or collaborate on projects. And Spry's Foundation CEO Peter Diamandis believes this technology can change retail customer service. Customers might try on virtual avatars or sit in amphitheater seats before buying. Number 5. Biometrics. It can recognize users by their face, voice, or fingerprint. This technology may finally end the password paradigm when it develops and becomes more pervasive. Because most people have ineffective passwords and never update them, hackers often require just one hit to gain access to personal and professional data. Managing the system can be a hassle for even the best. Passworders. So Biometrics promises much-needed data security. A fingerprint is far more difficult to steal than a password, and the complexity increases exponentially when numerous markers are utilized. Number 4. Serverless computing. That's not true serverlessness. It's hard to give computational resources without a physical server somewhere. Instead, this technology better distributes resources. Nothing happens when no application is running. The computing power autoscales when needed. This technical development means enterprises no longer need to worry about infrastructure or bandwidth reservations, resulting in ease of use and cost savings. One of the joys of this architecture is that you only pay when a service runs, writes Eric Knorr, Editor-in-Chief of International Data Group Enterprise. You don't need to pay for unused capacity. Basically, the runtime waits for an event, then swaps in the proper code and executes. So you can design a massive, complex program without paying anything until it runs. Number 3. 5G and the Internet of Things. 5G isn't particularly exciting. After 4G, what's another G? But it will be exponential. 5G networks may be 100 times faster than 4G, allowing more devices to connect, lowering latency, and improving signal reliability. This wireless technology will support the Internet of Things IoT, which will extend the Internet's power beyond computers to objects, processes, and environments. Smart cities, robot-driven agriculture, and self-driving highways are all possible with IoT. This one-two punch will keep current trends going and propel them forward. With 5G, remote offices become more reliable, and real-time data transfer of live events or desktop captures is smooth. The IoT helps remove unnecessary steps that slow productivity. If the manufacturing floor collects, curates, and sends data to the factory floor, why should anyone else bother? Number 2. Sun-powered chemistry. Many of the chemicals we use are made from fossil fuels. However, a novel technology that uses sunlight to transform waste carbon dioxide into usable compounds has the potential to reduce the sector's emissions. Recent. Advances in the sunlight-activated catalysts required for this process are a step toward building solar refineries that can manufacture useful molecules from waste gas, such as pharmaceuticals, detergents, fertilizers, and textiles. Number 1. Quantum computing. 
Quantum computing uses collective quantum state features like superposition and entanglement to execute computations. It solves problems faster and more precisely than modern supercomputers. However, we can expect quantum computers to form the backbone for the upcoming technologies outlined above. IBM has revealed intentions to construct a 1,000-qubit version by 2023, a milestone scientist Jay Gambetta called the inflection point. This technique could help manage large data. Rapid simulations could reduce costly and complex development time and address multivariable optimization problems. Finally, it may help solve intractable issues like natural language processing. Quantum computing also shows the dangers of tunnel vision in leaders. Focusing on one new technology or future model risks your company's survival. It's not about which technology will win, but about how they can function together. The innovation that these technologies will offer over the next few years will be stunning, especially when they're used in tandem, said Mike Haynes, head of the Emerging Technology Communities Executive Council on the CompTIA BizTech podcast. Business executives will have to navigate these technology advances for years to come. They can avoid hazards and capitalize on developing technologies by having an open mind. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comments section below. If you enjoy this video, all other video we share with you and want to hear from us again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.